Leck and Greg Vegan Camp, the 1st of January 2024. Happy New Year and special edition, the Sweet Bamboo Forest. We need to pick papayas prematurely because the papaya fruit will ripen on one side faster and this gets uh, moldy and bad before the other side and even the top. So it's a bit strange why this happens. If you know anything about papayas and why they ripen up this strangely like this, please let me know in the comments below. As you can see, one of the final tasks from Fabian was to clear out the bamboo forest. So when the new shoots come out in the rainy season, it will be easier to harvest them. And also the branches around here are cut. When humans, like us, walk around, we can walk around without getting a lot of branches in our faces. So thank you very much Fabian for helping out. Also Fabian will be leaving us after a period of two years so it has been uh, super nice to have him uh, around to help out and as a friend and as a family member so it's super nice and he's going back to Austria and he might be back in two years we hope he will come back Fabian you're welcome back in two years see you later even when it's the dry season we get shoots coming out um, that are edible right now and also the reason for this is that we are at the end of the main water pipe so the the main water pipe is there and then we have the flushing of the pipes when there is something wrong with the water from the temple and then we flush out the water around here also watering the the plants around here including the some parts of the bamboo forest here is the progress of the off-season pumpkin plant. Whoops, whoops. And this is a bean. Wow. We also have a off-season bean and in-season tomato plants. Secret, secret seeds from a country far, far away. And this is the asparagus field. Let's see if we can find an asparagus. And here is an area that is not covered by by any grass cuttings or weeds. Cutting, cuttings from weeds. It just dries out so fast during this season compared to an area that is like covered with something like this. It's still moist under which is perfect and also these weeds I don't want them in this area right now but otherwise these weeds are also protecting the soil from 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 the Sun and stuff. Another secret tomato and here we have two small nice asparagus shoots coming up oh, another one here so every day or every other day you can come and pick some asparagus if you want excellent raw vegan morning snack and we still have some mulberries but we are actually not able to eat any of them because the birds eat them before they ripen up so we have it a lot of birds running around eating the mulberries. Not running, but flying. Birds can run a little bit too. I've seen them run on the ground. But otherwise they fly, flap their wings and fly away. Amazing roses all around here. Makes uh, the morning walks very fragrant. And we still can see the moon and mountains. So the air is quite nice still. Leg is preparing for growing more vegetables around here too. And here is the new building where, uh, like community building, where we will be able to have Lex products to, for show and the community can come and dry products too. And we will have a, like a safe zone during the smoke season because it, uh, it will be a building that will be completely sealed off with the air filter inside. It will be easier to be around here during the smoke season so we don't need to hide in our tents all the time when the smoke is above um, breathing limits. Hi. 
these two last pumpkins. Let's see if they will ripen up. Many mango trees are gone. Mm, the chilies are gone prematurely because the birds love to eat the chilies too because they don't have they don't have the receptors for feeling the the spiciness of chilies so they just eat these and poop out the seeds all over the place so we get more chili plants which is also very nice Fabian is showing off his skills of trimming the banana plants and removing the, the weeds so it's easier to get to the bananas Say hi Fabian! Yeah, 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 yeah. show off your vegan strength <laughs> yeah, he, he, can, he forgot English So we have this triple, triple tree area with papayas and as, we, as you can see so over up there they are already getting orange and yellow and, and this is already getting like some kind of thing here which is like I, ne I need to harvest this one because otherwise it just gets more and more sick and this one actually too that one this one actually looks pretty healthy still but it's already a little bit soft And look at that one, I think it's almost like the birds are eating them. So also, before birds eat them, we also need to harvest them. Ah, an important update, we had two guests, two extra guests during uh, December. And one was in this bamboo hub and, and Fabian was uh, of course in uh, the hut, the bigger hut over there. And then we had another person staying in the this hut over here so it's um, yeah we were a bit busy and recently Fabian fixed the bamboo hut up in the tree so it's ready if people want to stay in the tree house so just you need to be careful because this ladder is not attached but it's pretty stable you can go up the floor has been fixed and yeah it's a nice little bamboo thing. So this is how it looks inside. Windows, fresh air and it's actually nice and cool during the day too because we have like very nice metal sheet that like reflects any heat most of the time and also the, the tree, the leaves keeps everything cool and nice and yeah otherwise you can also chill and hang out up here because like some buildings are, are get quite hot during the day but everything right now during this time we have quite cold nights so it's just like I'm sleeping with, uh, with skiing under underwear um, so just have in mind it's cold right now it's cold in Thailand during the nights at least here you have a view from the one side you can keep an eye on the fruit cage and see when the bananas are ripe and also check if the pumpkins are still there and if you rotate you just have the view outside and you can see the garden through some peak holes in the tree this longan tree so this is an extra special new year special we are in the in the cave and uh, and fabian's fabian's light is uh, already already done which I, it's not my light it's greg's light <laughs> He's responsible for charging for the volunteers. I'm just a helpless volunteer. Oh, Fabian, you have the protection rings too on your arms. That's sure. good. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hold with the ladder, na? One hand. Always on the ladder until you are on the metal. And this is into the catacombs of the dragons. Nobody has been here before. So scary. Would you go or not? I don't know if this is a waterfall of salt or minerals and bats 
and bat poopings. We heard the bats inside here. I don't know what will happen if we go inside here. 500 million bats. Oh yeah. Oh, they're flying there. Did you see those? Last time I didn't hear them here. Even though I've never been here before. It's moist. And completely different air. I think that's the last chamber. Goodbye, Fabian. Mm. Fabian says it's hot. It smells bad. So how was the cave? It was awesome. Got a little adrenaline kick, but it was good. It was really good. 